How far would you go to stand up for what you believed was right? Though few clones ever took the action to stop the Empire's tyranny, Captain Hauser was willing to commit treason for what he thought was right. The clone captain was initially deployed to the Twi'lek homeworld of Ryloth to free the planet from Separatist occupation, a cause joined by General Cham Syndulla and the Twi'lek resistance fighters under the agreement that the Republic forces would withdraw after the war. Hauser ended up remaining on the planet to see that the Galactic Empire honored no such agreement. Instead, the clone captain, still outfitted in his teal blue Phase II clone armor, continued serving as a stormtrooper officer in the new Imperial Army, where he led a squad of clones in the capital city of Lassu. Having developed a relationship with Cham and his wife Eleni, Hauser assured the Twi'leks of their safety. But when he saw the true nature of the Empire and the intentions of Vice Admiral Rampart, he was left with a choice. Follow orders against everything he fought for, or honor his pledge to defend the people he swore to protect. Ultimately, he chose to aid Clone Force 99, Syndulla, and his allies in escaping and in a final act of defiance, spoke out against the Empire and called for his brothers to do the same.